The seventh round of the National Motocross Championship will see Milton Obota Kenna feature in two race categories. The youngster will do two rounds in the 65cc class before having a go in the 85cc category. This as he prepares to graduate to the 85cc class next year as mandated by the competition rules. It's not really my choice because they said when you reach 13 you're supposed to be in 85 and I'm 12. Then next year I'm turning 13, so you can't do 65. Then when you turn 13, you go to 85. So I just said, let me, ne like next year, let me just be in 85. Akena is ranked third in the 65cc category behind his cousin Mito Nobota Kaki and Nida Jeremiah Mawanda. There is little to choose between the top riders in the category, so much so that Akaki believes he's the best 65cc rider in the country. I'm not scared of any of my competitors. Uh, if they start in front of me, I'm going to try to pass them. If they start behind me, I'm going to make sure they don't pass me. I'm going to try to do my best to do well in this race so I can do well in this race, do well in the next race and take the cha championship for myself. Father Afield, MX1 leader Arthur Bleak hopes to stay on top of the pile despite the return of Maxim Van P. On his part, Maxim insists that it is not over until it's over. It's going to be tough, uh, but like, you, like I said, you know, in motocross you never know. Uh, I'm not hoping for anything to happen, but it's just in this sport you, you never know. It can be a mechanical issue. It can be a, a gate that drops and you, 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 you try to, I mean, you knock into the gate. Small things like this can make a difference um, and same could happen to me. So I cannot say it's very unlikely that I'll have this championship, but it's still, it's still open as long as, uh, as races are still, are still there. Mountain Dew Fire and Safety Appliances and Shell were unveiled as the event sponsors this morning. Sam Poza, NTV Sport.